the Ozarks. Well, folks, looking at satellite right now, we're seeing those clouds, and uh, you can see them here. They're still out there for some. They're still kind of moving in from the west to the east. They are starting to break apart just a little bit, seeing a patch of sun over Springfield. When you get the moment of sun for the midday hours, you're going to feel the heat go up. That's just what happens. You get rid of the cloud, the sun, it comes out, and uh, yeah, we heat things up. Now, later today, these clouds aren't going to be out there. We'll be probably looking at mostly sunny skies for the afternoon hours. Right now, it's looking at radar, seeing a few rain showers now off to the east, Rolla, Salem, up to Lake Ozark. Seeing some uh, rain showers there moving up again off towards kind of the St. Louis area, easterly direction. Most of us are going to be remaining dry after we get these lingering rain showers out of our eastern counties over the next hour or so. Not a whole lot of rainfall from those, really just sprinkles to light rain showers out there around the midday hours. Temperatures right now 82 degrees in Branson. Looking at southwest winds, 7 miles an hour, dew point of 70. Yuck, that is very humid out there, no doubt about that. 84 in Springfield is the air temperature, air temperature of 90. Already in places like Camden, so we're starting to warm up a little bit and you get some sun to break out of the clouds, you'll get even warmer. And then the cloud comes back, you'll find some shade. That's not going to be with us all the time, though. Dew points right now, pretty muggy, especially in the southwest where dew points are in the 70s. That's very humid down there in that direction. Springfield dew point 67. Tack on the humidity, mix it with the air temperature, and you get a heat index of the upper 80s to low 90s already in places like Nevada and Joplin. 89 is what it feels like in Camden. It feels like 87 here in Springfield with an air temperature of 84. Wind speeds now generally from the south. Pretty breezy though, south 10 to 20 miles an hour, gusting to 30 miles an hour from the south here in Springfield. Joplin seeing winds from the south gusting at their strongest 25 miles per hour. So a stronger gust certainly in play for today as we're going to see the south winds howl for today. The feel like forecast, again we talked about the humidity, could feel like 100 degrees for today, feel like 105 to maybe even 110 off in the west for tomorrow. It's a hot one, the humidity is not going anywhere and then Friday still looking like humid 100 to 105 degrees on your feel like forecast for Thursday and Friday. Looking at future cast again, the clouds are here partly for now, becoming mostly sunny for this afternoon. We'll be turning up the heat then. It'll be a hot day today, no doubt about it. Then tomorrow will be mostly sunny, not seeing a whole lot. There will be some storms that go around us to our north through St. Louis off towards Illinois. We'll be dry for tomorrow. There is the data continues to indicate there could be some scattered rain showers in the north for tomorrow evening. I think most of us will stay dry and most of us will stay sunny going into your Friday. Another hot day on Friday with 101 for Thursday, 101 on your Friday, 90 on Saturday. Something changes here. We're going to have this little storm system come through with a cold front. That'll also give us a chance for some rain, scattered showers and storms on your Saturday. Temperatures though will be milding out to around 90 on Saturday, a little better on Sunday. Still hanging on to a slight chance of rain Sunday. And then guys right now, Tuesday or 4th of July, looks like there's about a 30 to 40% chance of seeing some scattered showers during the daytime on Tuesday. We'll just have to wait and see how Tuesday evening plays out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now a lot of people obviously not thrilled about the heat, but I think right. what more people may be looking at is this rain on the weekend because a lot of people kicking off their 4th of July weekend celebrations and things. Oh, yes. So yeah, that rain, um, certainly something we'll be keeping an eye on as we get closer to it to time it out. Absolutely. Good time so. to download that Keller 10 weather app too, if you don't have it. That's right. Tom.